all right guys so as you can see here we have completely unlocked uh, this phone now to show you that this phone is actually on android 13 let me go to settings and then we'll go to embed phone and i'll click on software information guys as you can see this one is on android version 13 so we have successfully unlocked this forgotten samsung 812 pattern what's up guys welcome back to the channel guys in this tutorial i'm going to be sharing with you guys how to unlock a forgotten samsung pattern now i'll be demonstrating this by using the samsung 812 now i know you might have watched a good number of videos here on youtube on how to unlock a forgotten samsung pattern and most of them is not actually working now the reason why this is not working is because now you have a phone that is running on android 13 and the video you are watching was actually made with a phone on lower edition of uh, android and that is the reason why this is not working now in this video i'm going to be sharing with you guys another trick which you can use to unlock a forgotten samsung pattern that is running on android version 13 all right for us to follow along with this tutorial now we need three things here now the first thing you need here now is a laptop now you need a laptop now it doesn't really matter if it's a window laptop or an apple laptop and then you need a type c charging cable which are using to charge your android phone if you have these three things here and finally is your smartphone all right so if you have these three things here guys we are good to go in the tutorial all right so with that being said let's get started guys So the very first thing you want to do here now is to connect this cable to your laptop so you just want to connect it to your system here like this and then um the next thing here now is to plug the phone as you can see the phone is completely locked right now if i want to restart the phone here i'll be requested to enter in my pattern which i don't know which i've forgotten if i still want to power off the phone here i'll be requested to enter in my to draw in my pattern which i don't actually know now the first thing i'm going to do here now is to perform a hard restart on the phone so just follow the step that i'm going to be showing you guys so just perform a hard restart now i'm going to hold the power button the volume that button combine these two buttons together until when the phone is about to restart as it's about to restart then you switch from the volume down button and then you hold the volume up button and then you still maintain your power button that you are holding with this hand all right so let's do this together so i'll just hold these two buttons together i'll just combine the both of them together and then i'll hold it for a couple of seconds all right as the phone is about to restart you switch to uh, the volume up button and then you wait for samsung to display once the samsung uh, displays then you connect the the cable to your phone so let's wait all right so at this point you want to do this quickly so just connect connect this and then you hold the volume down button and then the power button together just combine it again all right so uh, it's about to restart again then you switch over to the volume up button now this is going to uh, take us directly into the recovery mode of this phone all right guys so here we don't need this again all right so at this point you need to uh scroll down until when you see wipe data and factory reset so you just want to select wipe data and factory reset all right so we have a message here that if your phone is reset you may need to enter the google account information the email address and any password associated with this one to be able to use it again all right guys so you need your google account credential that you are using on the phone before the phone got locked because when we are setting up the phone you actually need to provide it all right so that's the frp of this phone all right so let's click on this power button you just click on it and then finally you select on factory data resets and then you click on the power button to select that so you want to click on it and then you wait until you get a message like this data wipe re complete all right so at this point you want to click on reboot just select the power button and then let the phone reboot so let's wait until when the phone restarts now this is not only applicable to samsung a12 it's also applicable to other models of samsung all right so it's actually going to take time for the phone to uh, restart uh, because this is the first time boot immediately after the hard reset which is just performed on the phone all 
now like i said i'm doing this with a phone that is running on android version 13 and that's the latest android operating system that has been released all right and it was released on august 15th uh, last year that's about seven months ago so after it was released there are a good number of security authentication that was included in, in the phone so the thing that might be working before might not be working again so that's exactly what i'm using this method and it's actually working on all samsung phone that is running on android version 13 all right so let's wait until the phone reboots now this is actually going to take time but we'll just have to wait until the uh, reboot time is complete Right guys so here we are in the setup stage now so i'll just go ahead and select start so i'll leave it at the default option which is english here i'll agree to all this and then i'll click on agree all right guys so at this point we need a wi-fi connection for us to set up this one so i'll just go ahead and then turn on my wi-fi hotspot from here so we can quickly use it and then set up this phone select next So it seems my network didn't work so let me try again guys okay guys so here is the uh the, the the stage here right now now at this point we are giving two option here is that we put in the pattern which we don't know and then we are provided with another option to enter in our google account credential all right so i'll select on use my google account instead so here i'll just go ahead and input in my google account which is on this phone before i forgot the pattern so once i put it i'll be able to have access to the phone again so here i'll just enter in the google account Alright guys, so as you can see here, we have completely unlocked uh, this phone. Now to show you that this phone is actually on Android 13, let me go to settings and then we'll go to bad phone and I'll click on software information. Guys, as you can see, this one is on Android version 13. So we have successfully unlocked this forgotten Samsung A12 pattern 
on this android device all right so if today is your first time here on the channel guys i would like you to subscribe to the channel and turn on the bell notification so anytime that i drop a new content just like this on this my youtube channel you'll be notified and then you come and watch the video all right guys so this is very easy like i said now you just need a, a charging cable and then you need a laptop now you don't have to install any special software you just want to make sure that the laptop is turned on and then you connect it to your phone and then that's it so it's not very hard all right so guys that is it for this tutorial guys if you enjoyed this video, i would like you to give this video a thumbs up and also drop down in comments in the comment section all right so with that being said guys see you guys in the very next tutorial bye for now